Activision's hiring, EA delays, and boobs. Today's, oh my god, this week was for the win. Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm your host, Luke Brown. You may remember me from Hadco Games, all sorts of sports, and from my guest starring role as the shark in Jaws 3D. That was you? Eh, for the most part. It's been an absolutely crazy week with a ton of ridiculous stories, so let's just jump right in to this week's edition of Oh My God, This Week Was For The Win. Yeah! <laughs> Gaming headlines may be full of news like layoffs and cutbacks, but for Activision, recession means now hiring. Case in point, their recent job listing for an art services screenshot associate. Just what do you need to do? Well, for example, you'll be asked to serve as lead on screenshot production, including screen capture, image processing, and archiving. You'll oversee multiple projects to ensure the content guidelines and deadlines are met. Finally, you'll be asked to perform advanced retouching of screenshots and teach skills to others as needed. Wait a minute. Did I read that right? You you guys want to hire someone who makes amazing photoshops. Well, shit. I've got my resume right here. Can, can we post these pics up, up here? I, and don't just put them in the corner. I mean, like, full screen them, all right? I want everybody to see the mastery that is, that is my art. All right, so, you know, right here. Like, look at this. Wow. You, you cannot oh, teach man, these kind of skills. Uh, I'm what they call a prodigy. Hey, cats. That cat looks like it's really there. Yeah, see? I, I dare them not to hire me. <laughs> EA also had a shit ton of announcements last week, and to get you all caught up, I'm going to recount every single one to you in under 15 seconds. Got your timer ready? EA recorded a loss of $650 million and will be laying off 11% of the workforce. Sims 3 was pushed back from February to June. Dragon Age Origins slipped from this year to next. Godfather 2 is going to be pushed back to allow for some more time to build some hype. Mass Effect 2 sequel on the works. Also, Battlefield Bad Company getting a sequel. Oh, and P.S. Dead Space Wii. What'd I miss? Nothing. Fuck. That was awesome. Yay! Yes. <laughs> Michael Machines guy can suck it. His name's John Massey Jr. Yeah, whatever. That's we don't good. usually talk about exceptionally good news here on Oh My God, This Week Was For The Win, but just this one time, I'm willing to make an exception. Yes. Yay. E3 appears to be relaxing their invitation-only attendance policy, now opening the floor to anyone who can prove with two forms of identification that they work within the industry. All right. Here are mine. <laughs> <laughs> That's great, but honestly, that's not what got this story on such a highly rated show. The exhibitors are also planning to allow models back onto the show floor. Woohoo! I think I speak for everyone when I say, Dear Lord, baby Jesus, up there in your ghost manger, just looking at your baby Einstein developmental videos, learning about shapes and colors, thank you for bringing Booth Babes back to E3. Amen. <laughs> you believe it. Now, I'm not going to lie, this story was pretty much an excuse for me to have pictures of scantily clad women posted right next to me, and even though they're not real, I know that this is pretty much as close as I'm going to get to anyone this classy. So, please, please, don't take that away from me. <laughs> you just witnessed the greatness that was my hosting of Oh My God, This Week Was For The Win. Yay! We'll see you next time. God, I need a drink. Luke. Oh, what? Dude, what? What? On the air? Yeah. Hey, everybody at home, I need to drink.